Oh my goodness, you guys, it's been forever. <laughs> so beautiful. <laughs> I can't wait to share this with you. Where should we go? All right, I have no idea where we should go. I haven't done this in 11 months, according to my son. <laughs> and uh, I'm excited, I'm ready to go. I do know one thing, I want to go somewhere, you know, nature-y, not necessarily into the city. So I'm going to head out of the city and let's just go see. <laughs> Okay, I have arrived at Valens Lake and I'm not exactly sure where I'm going to go, but there are beautiful trails to walk and the guy at the front said, be very careful not to slip on the ice. I think that would be bad. So <laughs> I'm going to not slip on the ice and go take some pictures. I'm so looking forward to doing this. It's been so long. I really lightened my bag. All I have today is this one lens. Uh, yeah, I only brought the one lens, 70 to 300, and, uh, and my usual old camera that I've had forever. It seems really, really cold here. Colder than it was at home. Definitely chilly, <laughs> but it's just beautiful. Okay, so we have the lake over here. This is Valens Lake, and there are, I don't know, just some pretty places to walk. Now, <laughs> the question is, in the snow, can I find where these pathways start? I think it's over that way, but I can see where somebody has made a pathway, so that's where I'm gonna go. good to be back out it is so beautiful it's very cold <laughs> so I know this park really well John and I have spent a lot of time here uh, the lake is just beautiful it's not too far from home and so we've done a lot of camping and so on at this park so I know that if I go the other way then I'm just heading towards like the beach shop and uh, you know, bunch of buildings, open spaces. There's not really as much, uh, you know, hiking in the woods then. But if I head this way, it's a big, big loop. And actually the path I think goes all the way around the lake. I could be thinking of another one. There are a few around here, but it's really nice. So I'm heading actually towards the campgrounds.
Isn't this so cool how the, uh, the red and the beige mix together? I just love this. cold. <laughs> so it has been a long, long time. It has been 11 months, as I said, and oh, look, there we go. Danger, unsafe ice. Yeah. <laughs> so where are we? You are here. And I'm going to walk along the trail. I'm going to walk along. I don't know if I'm going to actually make it all the way around the lake. You could actually go all this way. This is the end of the park, so you do have to walk on the road out here, but it is a beautiful walk and I do so enjoy it. However, for today, I'm just going to walk and see what I find. So I suppose I could go over to the fishing bridge or I could just head on the path. Why not? Let's start with the bridge. This is it, the fishing bridge. Do I look cold? <laughs> it's very cold today. So I think what I'm gonna try and take a picture of is just this, the lake, see behind me with the trees there. It's just a desolate winter picture. And um, you know, if you live in Canada, this is something you see a lot, <laughs> but, um, it's also just part of who we are. We have these beautiful northern wilderness, um, very, very cold um, lands. All right, so my camera is on ISO 200. It's very bright out here because of the snow. However, because it's so bright, the whites, the light colors tend to be blown out in the picture. So I've got the exposure value at minus and uh, hopefully that'll help me to get just a little bit of detail. Ooh, kind of wish I had my uh, 16 to 35 because there's like this ice down here and I think that would be a really beautiful lead in to the trees. Oh well, next time. to go back onto the pathway where I'm not exposed to just this really cold wind. Okay, that's better. <laughs> it's okay to stop and warm up your hands. 
John bought me for Christmas a battery operated heated jacket. It's so amazing. It's so great and it fits right underneath my other jacket and it's nice and warm. I think I've been thinking about this for I don't know how many years and I've never done it but I think I might get uh, battery operated heated gloves and I guess the trick will be finding ones that work for photography however no matter what it's worth it <laughs> if you live in any sort of northern or very southern climate and it gets very cold in the winter protect your hands What else have I been doing with my time? I have a job, my face is frozen. I can barely talk. <laughs> I have a new job that I just love. It's, uh, it's wonderful. And uh, so I'm working part time. I like that. Ah, oh, my cheeks are not moving. <laughs> and uh, I've started making my own music. It's so much fun. Um, I'll give you a little sample, like maybe I'll be using some of my own music for my videos from now on, I don't know. Oh, I saw these cool trees that have snow just on the one side of them. I can't help but just stand here and take a few pictures. I'm not sure whether I want it to be a low aperture or a high one, but they look neat. vlog is not about the amazing pictures that I'm going to get. It is about getting out, being thankful, and freezing. <laughs> I've learned something and that is that you have to live each day. Don't regret anything. See the good side and live. <laughs> so here I am. I'm out. I'm living. I get to go out and take pictures again. This is completely amazing. Okay, bye.